What's up, Total Promotions? I'm Kyle here, your admin, here with uh, Beyond Creation. Uh, now, before we start here, what's a little bit of a brief history on your band? Like, when did you start? Oh, you know, where are you guys from? Uh, well, actually, uh, the band, well, the band started in 2005, uh, which was me and another guitar player. Uh, at the time, I was uh, writing stuff, music and everything. Uh, but it was kind of hard uh, to find the right people to play because it's pretty like technical and I yeah. wanted uh, like musicians that, that were already able to, to play it. Uh, so it took about like uh, four years uh, and yeah, actually uh, I met Kevin, a uh, guitar player, it was very funny because uh, I just got into uh, a New job at the time, and uh, he was he was there at the job, and uh, we were talking about uh, the band, and uh, I, I make him listen to, uh, to the songs and everything. It was really uh, enjoying it. So uh, yeah, uh, he decided to join the band as a second guitar player, and it's just about like 2008. That uh, Gio, our first drummer, uh, joined the band too. Uh, so yeah, from there uh, we were like almost a fully band, yeah. <laughs> uh, and we're uh, writing stuff and uh, playing jamming, and we got finally contact uh, contact with Forest. Uh, which at the time was playing Augury and uh, Covetis and everything and we were like a big fan of his work and uh, musical uh, path. So uh, we contacted him and he was really uh, enjoying your stuff so he decided to uh, join the band Oops. and yeah from there uh, we finally uh, get all the pieces together and the Diora was about, uh, yeah, it took about one year to record everything, uh, and 2011 was the first album out. So, yeah, since then we've been playing shows, <coughs> and uh, I, uh, I started writing music, uh, new music for the second album, and some uh, between tours and everything. Uh, it was a uh, band member change, yeah. Uh, so yeah, finally in 2013 we recorded uh, our new album which is Earthborn Evolution and yeah, it's, it's right over here, we're uh, touring with this album and people really enjoy it. And I think it's more like a progressive uh, way more progressive and uh, uh, yeah, there's many other influences on the second album than the first one, so yeah. Awesome. Um, now how did you guys come up with the band name Beyond Creation? Well, at first uh, the band was Behind Creation. Okay. Uh, some, some people uh, knew it, but uh, yeah, it was Behind Creation and we thought about like I don't know, it's... Behind Creation was cool, but we wanted to get something that doesn't really have like boundaries, because yeah. our, our kind of mentality is that uh, we play music, not, not just like one style, we play what we like yeah. to play, you know? So that's where we, we got uh, change to Beyond Creation. Okay. So. Um, now the internet describes you kind of as like a progressive death metal or a technical death metal band. Uh, would you agree with that, or what kind of genre do you feel that your music is more, um, I guess, to say more sounds like? Yeah. Well, uh, of course, like uh, the first thing uh, was progressive because yeah. uh, we listen to a lot of different kind of music and wanna play what we like. So. Uh, Jazz, classical music, and rock, and whatever. So, um, as I could describe, the genre should be like progressive techno death metal. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, just mix 
mixing a little bit of everything. Yeah, the nice little mix of everything. Yeah. There. Uh, um, and what do you feel the biggest problems the metal scene today faces as compared to, let's say, when you guys first started out? Um, well, I don't know about like uh, problems because everyone can do it. You know, it's it's not like you just need to uh, push hard, look forward, and uh, do do what you love to do with art. And I guess like there's really a lot of bands uh, that comes out uh, now these days more than than ever, and that's that's a good thing because like you can uh, if you wanted to, you can start a band and uh, yeah. I think the, maybe the one problem would be that there's so much like bands, uh, saturation that uh, there's kind of a, when you start, uh, there's so much band that will uh, get to play shows and everything and, and so you, you need to push forward and maybe harder to get your place, uh, get your place done. So. Now with social media evolving over time, do you think that it helps fans more to have more platforms of social media? Or do you feel that it is in a way creating this kind of elitist environment where it beats out a lot of the other bands and makes more seem uh, superior to the others? Like where, let's say for example, people are more into progressive metal where they're like, oh, all metal more bands are garbage. Like, do you feel that social media is helping fans get more noticed? That's a pretty good good tour we're on with uh, Revocation too and Rivers of Nile that we're actually uh, touring in uh, North America. So yeah, it should be uh, our first step in Europe and I'm glad to finally see you. No doubt. Anyways, uh, this has been Carl and Simon Giraud from uh, Beyond Creation.